Welcome to Indian Canyons in Palm Springs. This is sacred lands for the Native Americans. And from here, I'm going to share with you a Qigong sequence that is really good for neck and shoulders. And it's really good uh, to practice in the spring. In the spring, we have what we call a liver chi rising. Yeah, We have uh, a lot of energy in the spring and it rise up to the head. And that can cause headaches, migraines, stiff neck and stiff shoulder. So if you suffer from problems in your shoulder or neck, this chi break is going to be, this sequence would, would be really great for you. So let's uh, start by just releasing tension in the, using this movement. So we're going to start this movement. You, what you're going to do is you're just going to bounce up and down with your hip, when your hips. So the hips bouncing up and down, you're bending the knees. And because you're bending the knees, the arms are going back and forth. deep breathing in from the nose out from the mouth and soften the shoulders and soften the shoulder blades let me show you how it how it looks in profile yeah so you're bending the knees so you think about the hips as a as the arms as a pendulum so the movement starts from the hips and the upper body is very soft start to breathe into these joints so you can even close your eyes and feel these joints in the shoulders, the shoulder blades and the chest. When the arms go backwards, you have a stretch in the upper chest. When the arms go forward, you have a stretch in the upper back. So try to breathe into all of these area, kind of move the energy there. Soften this area, the upper, the upper area of the body. Exhale from the mouth, let the energy relax and go. And relax this movement. Let's start another movement with the neck. We're gonna put both hands behind the back. You can hold one wrist and just turn the head, circle the head. Now, as you circle the head, you make circles with the head. See if you can soften muscular tension in the neck. Do it very gently. Focus on exhalation from the mouth. Inhale from the nose very slowly. See if you can feel the weight of the head soften the jaw. Soften any expression on the face, soften the forehead, soften the tongue, the eyelid. And then let's reverse direction. You might find that there's areas that are still stiff here. Just glide over areas that are not agreeable. Just glide over them and not press, push into them. I'm gonna open these areas softly with multiple movements today. And then chin to the chest. Take a deep breath into the base of the skull. Separate the hand, exhale and lift the head up. Let's put one hand on the heart, the other palm is pressing to the horizon, shoulders down, palms erected. Look over the hand and look away. Look over the hand and look away. One more time. Let's change the hand so one arm is gonna press forward you kick with the heel of the palm the shoulder relax the elbow is relatively straight it's not locked but it's straight fingertips pointing to the sky look in and look away a few times deep breathing relaxed breathing when we're trying to open the body we're trying to release blocked energy we want to engage with soft calm and full breathing I'm gonna just 
relax. You want to relax stress, relax blockages. You want to come into a place of relaxation and the breath will do it best. Nice and relaxable hand. And let's do another stretch and this is going to be a stretch for the triple warmer. And uh, this is a really good uh, for releasing stress. So we actually turning the hands like so. Yes, yeah, so the palm face up, the arms are 45 degrees and relax the head to one shoulder and go back and forth across one shoulder. Now what you're going to feel is this is a stretch exactly for the triple warmer meridian. Where does it go? So you can feel it on the back of the ear. If you do it right, shoulders down, you feel on the back of the ear. Breathe there. Going all the way to the back of the arm and back of the head. Chin to the chest and roll to the other side. This is a beautiful, beautiful one to open lines of tension here at the neck. Palm face the body, chin to the chest, take a deep breath into the base of the skull and lift the head up. Roll the shoulder open. Exhale, relax. Inhale. Open the chest, roll the shoulder back. Exhale, relax. So it's a, like a wave, yeah? Inhale. Exhale, tuck the tailbone under, roll, open the chest, relax, just one more time, and relax, and let's go into one arm at a time, inhale, exhale, in, exhale, squat down, in, Look at, just try to mirror me. Exhale, soften the whole body. Inhale, press the heel to the earth and then this side of the body lift. Exhale, as you press the heel to the floor, the other side, diagonal side of the body, lift up, that shoulder get lift up. Soften the whole body and feel how you trans transform the energy from the earth, up the leg, the heel, all the way to the shoulder. Soften the body, make it very malleable. Very soft, all the bones, all the joints are soft. Exhale, soften fully. Inhale. Big breath, long, silky breath in. Exhale from the mouth. and come up beautiful so this this each one of these section can be done longer eventually you're going to really release a lot of tension <laughs> i just want to share with you a full sequence each part of it can be done a little longer this is a beautiful sequence but let's open the palms to the sky and call your friends over yeah it's almost like you're calling your friends like come on over <laughs> okay, and palm face up. Let's put this palm down. So inhale, and you're ending up here, and turn. And then inviting the people from the other side. You see that my hips is moving too. And then let's alternate. Soften the spine, stay in the center. Angulate the spine. This movement will ripple out all the way through the tailbone. Deep breathing, inhale. From the nose, exhale from the mouth.
relax this movement. Feel the body. Feel the spine. Close the eyes. Feel the shoulders. Feel the neck. So we opened a little bit areas here. You can feel the chi a little bit moving, even though let's do the neck rolls again without putting the hands behind the back now. Just neck rolls, just relax the head. 360 degrees. And as this time is a very different one, because when you circle the head now, Try to see how the shoulders are also part of it. So when the head moves, the shoulders also move. Feel it. Feel it that the shoulders are actually connected to the neck. So when you roll the neck like this, the shoulders move and let them do it. and then roll to the other side. Let's turn to the chest, take a deep breath. Exhale, come up. Let's shake the hips and let the upper body, especially the neck, soften and the shoulders. So we're shaking, shaking the tree. Yeah, we're shaking, going up and down with the dantian, up and down with the hips. And as a consequence, the upper body is getting loose. Yeah, so you're not moving the head, you're moving the hips up and down. And let it, this movement ripple upwards, towards the shoulders and the neck. Inhale from the nose, exhale from the mouth. vibrate and scatter all the energy that is clogged there this is very very good for thinking too much being too much in our head now pause it and just feel the energy now all we're gonna do is we're gonna do an energetic practice to calm the mind it's the hands like so and we acknowledge the earth so we think about the earth as a force of healing energy. And as we inhale, we bring that earth chi up as a cooling energy from the earth. The earth is the element of grounding. Bring it all the way up to the crown, turn to the front, and then exhale with the sound of SH in a whisper. We take all the heat out from the head. This flow is very good if you have problem falling asleep or waking up in the middle of the night as well inhale up imagine cool energy from the earth coming up and hot energy like the monkey mind of too much thinking calm it down with the sound of sh in a whisper like you're telling somebody to be quiet so turn then inhale from the nose Think about the head, and then from the head, take the heat out. All the thoughts. Are melting down to the ground. Inhale, earth chi. Go down in your mind 200 miles into the earth, deeper. As you pulling up the chi to the side of the body, that cooling energy going up and this hot energy, this active mind. Energy flowing down back to the earth. Two more here, inhale. Focus on breathing that energy up the side of the body. Turn, and then as you exhale.
when the exhalation is longer than the inhalation, the body calms down. So inhale to the count of three. And you can exhale to the count of five. One more. Nice, beautiful. Thank you guys so much. Let's put the hands on the navel, feet together. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope this movement improves circulation in the upper body, in the neck and shoulders. And you feel a bit more calm and relaxed, especially that last flow can be done separately, again, anytime you need it.